In the early spring, there's nothing more refreshing to me than to walk through a greenhouse like this and see so much potential growing. Just look at these gorgeous herbs. This greenhouse can hold between 40 and 45,000 of these plants. They're just getting ready to ship them out to your garden. Now what I love about this plant, which is Lavender Provence, is that it has an incredible bloom on it. It typically blooms in the summer. And Provence, for me, performs best in really well-drained soils. My garden soil is heavy clay, so I'm in the soil with lots of sand. The idea here is you want excellent drainage. Now, if your garden has heavy clay and you don't have raised beds, what you might try is growing Provence in a container. I did several years ago. I put three plants in a 24-inch terracotta pot and they were gorgeous. You see what I did is I put the three plants in there and as they grew together, which was up to about 24 inches tall, it looked like one giant plant. Very dramatic. Now if you think lavender grown this way is a feast for the eyes, just wait till you smell the foliage. The foliage alone is so incredibly aromatic, but the blooms, well, they're just off the charts. Honeybees love them, they love the nectar. You see, lavender honey is very sought after. Now, if you don't have room to plant all of these lavender plants to create a beautiful field of lavender like we've seen in postcards of Provence, France, take a little Provence, France, Place it on your patio by just taking three of these plants in a container. You'll be glad you did it. If you'd like more information on this topic or any other gardening topic, just check out my website, pallensmith.com.